Hi, my name is James Randall. I'm the Director of Donor Services here at South Texas Blood and Tissue Center, and I'd like to take you through a tour of one of our new blood mobiles and show you how these new incredible blood mobiles allow us to fulfill our mission every day. And heading back to the rear of the bus, we have our waiting area where donors first present. They're registered on our computer system, then they're provided a tablet. They answer the questionnaire on the tablet while they're sitting on the bench. After they've completed the questionnaire, they then enter the private health history room, and this is where they will meet with a staff member to review all of the responses to their health history questionnaire, perform their miniature physical exam, so the blood pressure, pulse, temperature, and a finger stick, to ensure that this will be safe for the donor, and then label their collection set. So after the donor has been screened in the room, they're then released to the hallway where they're able to donate. So the new blood mobiles are equipped with four donor beds. Each donor bed has its own donor monitor. The donor monitor is used to inform our donors uh, about the donations they're making and to show them the impact, to show them the face of the person whose life that they are touching. Uh, it also allows them to be distracted during the process so they don't have to focus on the blood donation itself. Each donor bed also has an individual fan for each donor. We've got the windows for the donors to look out and in the hot Texas sun at times there's a need to pull the shades down. So our blood mobiles are also equipped with our new state-of-the-art blood collection mixers. So these mixers actually wirelessly transmit data from our computer system and collect the right amount of blood from the donor based on their gender, their height, and their weight. Now this allows us to ensure that the donation process is as pleasant as possible by taking the right amount of blood based upon the donor's size. And this configuration is then repeated three other times throughout the vehicle. So behind the donor beds, we have our work counters that have a multitude of different configurations. So we can actually use the work counter as a flat work surface, or we can open the counter up and use automated collection technology. So devices that collect either red blood cells, platelets, or plasma from our donors. And these devices allow us to increase our efficiency and collect more units from fewer donors by their ability to collect just the specific blood component that they're targeting. So what you see is an all-inclusive mobile unit that allows us not only to register, but to screen and to collect donors by coming to the donor as opposed to the donor having to come to us. So we look forward to having an opportunity to increase our mobile fleet and to add two additional blood mobiles that will allow us to continue to further our mission throughout South Texas.